True Peace Kings. It's May 29th, 2020. And I'm back at y'all with another one. But if you're trying to stay ahead of the game, you should subscribe to Peter's Lane. Automation and digital transformation key for air transport industry recovery post COVID-19. Now that's the headline. But Peter's Lane, faced with COVID-19 challenges, the air transport industry is developing recovery strategies that boost safety and trust with a specific focus on digital transformation automation, sustainability, innovation, and customer experience, claims a new report released by Fast Future, Future Travel Experience, FTE, and the Airline Passenger Experience Association, APEX. Airports and technology providers have already begun exploring ways to increase passenger confidence with touchless biometrics. Titled the COVID-19 Air Transport Near Term Impacts and Scenarios, the report is part of a four-part series investigating how stakeholders see passenger flow and investment post-COVID-19. Despite market uncertainty, the report proposes four strategy scenarios. The findings highlight that the industry is experiencing and anticipating devastating impacts on flight volumes, passenger numbers, and revenues, said Rohit Tower. Fast Future CEO and lead author of the report in a prepared statement. The, the sector's recovery is dependent on government policy, health factors, passenger confidence, the nature of the economic recovery, and the extent of collaboration between industry players. We developed four scenarios exploring the interaction of these latter two driving forces and tested them on the webinar attendees. In the following two years, nearly 69% of air industry stakeholders expected a spike in digital transformation investment. 60.3% feel automation and AI deployment will increase, and 54.2% think sustainability and environmental initiatives will play a key role. More than half predict a push for innovation, while 48.5% forecast a higher interest in customer experience and service. Three quarters of respondents expect a drop in aircraft orders and more than half predict a lower interest in terminal design and construction. The report estimates the industry would need some two, three years to recover from the negative effects of COVID-19. In a webinar held in April, only 6% out of more than 900 responded trust the industry will bounce back in the next year. If new procedures are implemented for passenger safety, 30% believe people will start traveling again. There is no doubt that the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic will be felt for some time to come, and it is more important than ever that airports, airlines, and their partners take steps now to prepare for the new reality, said Daniel Coleman, founder and CEO of Future Travel Experience, in a prepared statement. Prioritizing health and safety efforts is a given, but all stakeholders must also commit to delivering a contactless, queueless, and fully sanitized end-to-end -end travel experience that is as automated as possible. Some radical new approaches and collaboration between all parties are essential to achieve this vision and support the survival of the air transport industry. Over 75% of survey respondents still believe in five key areas where airline and airport spending will grow or remain the same despite the COVID-19 headwinds, said Joe Leader, CEO Airline Passenger Experience Association, Apex and International Flight Service Association, IFSA, in a prepared statement. The winners during this challenging time, including digital transformation, automation, sustainability, innovation, and customer experience and service. That's positive news for Apex and IFSA, member airlines and suppliers. Market analysis have forecast that biometrics will drive a major increase in investment into airport operations over the next five years.